YouTube, Denise here from Seuss Art, and today we're going to, I thought it would be really fun if I brought you into the process of what I'm doing. So for the next project, I'm making my alcohol inks, and we're going to do this all day and all night. I'm also going to keep my videos 10 minutes long. I mean, everybody can easily lose track of what's going on, so let's set this up. And uh, when the timer dings, <laughs> when the timer dings, I'm going to go ahead and kill the video and start another one. Um, and you're going to see this process from the beginning to the end. All right, what we're doing is I want to make mica powder alcohol inks. How cool is that? That is very cool. Uh, I'm using a whole set of mica powders. And... Uh, I'm going to kind of bring you down here real quick, let you see. All different colors. And uh, today, we are, we're going to make the inks. And then we'll start making the art. So, let's do this. And the cool thing about mica powders with alcohol is you don't have to wait as if you were making uh, inks with uh, Sharpies or some kind of alcohol-based pen. So, let's get going. What I've done is um, I have these little bottles and they're wonderful but the problem is I don't have anything to shove the <laughs> the mica powders in so I'm using um, a clay tool that has a nice little scoop and I'm gonna do this on a silicone base so that whatever's left over I'm gonna go ahead and put in this here and it's gonna be a mishmash of colors but who cares I'll use it in an epoxy resin or something but there's gonna be no waste so let's get going oh my gosh thirsty again bubbly they don't sponsor me, but that water is amazing. This is cherry essence. Uh, there's no sugar. There's no artificial flavors. It's just carbonated water with the essence of cherry. Woohoo! All right, let's start with the pearl. And we'll just open this up. I'm not wearing gloves here because this is just like makeup. If I get it on my hands, I'll put some in my hair. I'll move my face. I'll be sparkly and fun. So let's scoop some of this out. We're going to put it right in the bottle. I'm probably going to go with uh, four scoops each. I'm going to go as quickly as I can. We only have 10 minutes. I did lose a considerable amount there, but no worries. All right. Now we're going to go with the blue, and uh, this is a mica powder set, and um, it's just an amazing brand. I wish I could see the brand on there. Deco Room, I guess. Er, <laughs> oh, that blue is gorgeous. I can't wait to see that. And again, what we're going to do is we're going to take these powders, and we are going to paint the back of, of what I want to be. Ooh, there goes the white. Um, I need to just slow down and use a little less so I don't waste. Well, I'm not really wasting, but whatever. White. Uh. There we go. There's three. I'm going to put that on my thinners, rub it through my hair. I love sparkles in my hair. I mean, I don't do it every day, but it's fun. All right, we're going to go ahead and use... Um, color I haven't used before which is a called kiwi this is a kiwi mica powder um, kiwis are beautiful and bright in the middle but um, <laughs> I don't know what do you think is that a kiwi I don't think so. but it's a kiwi color and we're gonna grab some of this and put it in a bottle Timer's ticking. I can hear it. Can you hear it? <laughs> One more. Like I said, we're going to do three scoops in each. That should give us a really pretty color. All right. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Moving along the lavender. Oh, we got five minutes. So, what I'll do is um, as many as I can till we're at three minutes and then... I'm going to add the alcohol and show you what 
what we get out of it. All right, for the sake of time, I'm gonna stop with these four. Oh, H. And let's add the alcohol and put the lids on. This is 91% ice pure alcohol. I'm gonna put this over here so I don't ruin the rest of my mica powders. I don't know if you can see me, you can see me. All right, we're gonna fill that up. It's one. And again, what we're doing right here together is I wanna do another conceptual piece, which means I have no clue what I'm doing, but I have an idea of the direction I wanna go. So we're going to take these inks today, today, and we are going to make a piece on glass, which eventually is going to have um, lights behind it because I really like that idea. I mean, I've seen some of my glass works. It looks really cool. So, all right. All right, we have alcohol in each and every one of those. Uh, this box used to be my daughter's uh, makeup box, uh, rest in peace, Ashley, um, and she has kindly given me permission to go ahead and use it. These are little tiny pieces that come with this, and they have very fine tips, and uh, they're childproof, which is a little bit of a pain in the ass. Oh, my bad. It's a pain in the butt. <laughs> but um, it does a really good job of sealing in uh, all the inks, and... Um, Assuring that they stay in the bottle, providing I put them on properly, and that's not always the case. They're tough to put on. Right, I'm, I'm not going to kid you on that one. All right, so I've learned the best way to do this is stick, oop, spray, pop, whatever. Ah. They truly do not like getting on their um, oh, paper towel. Here we go. Girl's, girl's best friend. Uh, we're going to just woman handle that puppy down in there. Ah. Does not want to go. Oh, wait. I remember how I did this best. Uh, mum, 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 mum. The pliers. The pliers. There we go. No, oh, I'm going to lose that powder but I'll start all over later. Oh. Yeah, these aren't the easiest bottles. I don't recommend purchasing them. I'm going to keep trying on other um, options that are available to me. They just don't want to snap. All right. <laughs> there it goes. Let me try this one. Well, that was fun. <laughs> that one decided it had some place it had to go. <laughs> okay. I had all this worked out at one time. I don't remember. Oh, there we go. Hold it. There we are. Ta-da! That's the process. You want that down there nice and tight. It could still go down a little bit more, so I'm going to go ahead and hold it. Put it on a flat surface and snap. That's oh, gonna have to do it. <clears throat> yeah, that's good. That's on there. So then we're gonna give it a good shake. It's not really on there. <laughs> I don't recommend these bottles, okay, just so you know, but it's all I've got right now, so I'm gonna work with it. <laughs> all right. Okay. That's, that's, all right, just so you know what we got, these are the inks we're going to be using this evening. Uh, the rest of the day, the rest of the evening. Um, if I have to tape around that sucker just so I can get it out the tip, I'm gonna. <laughs> All right, we have one second left. I'm gonna finish these bottles. I'll wrestle and cuss all by myself, and I'll see you on the other side with part two. Ciao, bella.